We invite you to open your hearts and minds as we embrace the power of love, compassion, and self-discovery. Prepare to be inspired, uplifted, and guided towards a higher understanding of ourselves and the world we inhabit. Welcome to I Am Love. It's about owning the idea of love, believing in the idea of love, and really, really harnessing that with everything you do. It's so often that we want to understand our partner, but sometimes it's really just about letting it be, observing, enjoying, staying in that present moment. And in that presence, in that moment, you're able to discover so much beauty that you would have missed with the focus of looking for certain ideas and traits, like the puzzle piece, one that fits in. That's love coach Paula Howe on how Emily discovered that true love is a lifelong journey of self-discovery, growth, and connection. The Puzzle of Love In a quaint town nestled between rolling hills, there lived a wise old puzzle maker named Samuel. Samuel was known for his intricate and captivating puzzles that challenged the mind and stirred the imagination. One day, a young traveler named Emily arrived in the town, seeking wisdom and guidance on matters of the heart. She'd been on a quest to find true love, but felt lost and disheartened by her failed attempts. Word of Emily's arrival reached Samuel, who saw an opportunity to offer her a unique perspective on love. He invited Emily to his humble workshop and presented her with a special puzzle called the Puzzle of Love. The puzzle consisted of countless interlocking pieces, each representing a different aspect of love. Samuel explained that finding true love was like solving a complex puzzle. It required patience, understanding, and a willingness to explore every intricate connection. Emily eagerly accepted the challenge and began fitting the puzzle pieces together. As she worked, Samuel shared his wisdom about love. He explained that love was not a finished picture waiting to be discovered, but rather a journey of discovery itself. Piece by piece, Emily discovered the joys and challenges of love. Some pieces represented trust, others vulnerability, while some embodied compromise and forgiveness. Each connection she made brought her closer to unraveling the puzzle's secrets. As Emily navigated through the puzzle, she realized that the most important piece was self-love. It was the foundation upon which all other pieces of love fell into place. Samuel explained that true love couldn't flourish without a deep appreciation and acceptance of oneself. Inspired by this realization, Emily began to focus on her own self-growth and self-care. She nurtured her passions, embraced her quirks, and learn to love herself unconditionally. With each piece she connected, the puzzle of love became clearer, and her understanding of love deepened. Weeks turned into months as Emily devoted herself to the puzzle. Eventually, she completed the final piece, unveiling a breathtaking image that represented love in all of its complexity and beauty. With the puzzle solved, Emily felt a profound sense of fulfillment. She thanked Samuel for his guidance and wisdom, realizing that true love wasn't confined to finding a partner, but was a lifelong journey of self-discovery, growth, and connection. Emily left the workshop with a newfound perspective on love. She understood that the puzzle of love was ever-evolving and that the joy lay in embracing the process rather than solely focusing on the end result. From that day forward, Emily approached relationships with an open heart and mind. She recognized that love wasn't about finding someone to complete her, but rather about two individuals coming together, each with their own unique puzzle pieces, to create a beautiful and harmonious connection. And so, Emily ventured into the world, carrying the wisdom of the puzzle of love with her. She embraced the journey, knowing that love would always be a beautiful and intricate puzzle, waiting to be explored and cherished. I can't help but think the last time that I opened a box to uh, start a puzzle and I debated, do I look at the picture? Do I not look at the picture? Do I create the puzzle? How will it come about? And I think that really defines what a relationship is. We could have an ideal picture, we could see it on the outside, and we can have all these ideas of what we think that relationship is going to be. And we know that there are different pieces, different angles, different frustrations in designing that. But ultimately, if we persevere, will end up with a completed puzzle. And that completed puzzle will have the memory of all that it took to complete, including the time. And for some, we might not even complete that puzzle. And for others, it may take 
decades, and for some, it may take days. So no matter where you are on your journey in your puzzle of relationship discovery, take a moment to take a deep breath and remember that at the end, there is something to receive at the end, no matter what the image looks like. That's love coach Paula Howe. In the next episode, hear how Maya discovered her own unique voice and the power it held to create a positive impact on others. We hope you enjoyed I Am Love, our gift to you from the I Am Love Foundation. Feel more love and less stress every day with the free I Am Love meditations at IamLoveFoundation.com and subscribe wherever you listen to your podcasts. I am Ross Uge, the founder of the I Am Love Foundation. Please visit us at www.IamLoveFoundation.com. Another Everything Podcast production. Visit everythingpodcast.com, a division of Patterson Media. Subscribe wherever you get your podcast.